It's entertainment time from Mr Entertainment himself, Braden, who's checking out the latest Kiwi Christmas movie. Let's take a look. Hello there, TGIF, I reckon, another Friday and some fabulous entertainment lined up today. I want to start by talking actually about a film suggested to me by Kate at Hoyts. We'll talk a little more about Hoyts and how you can do some winning with them a little later on. But this one is called Wonder and you're going to want to get your tissues out for this one. It's about young Augie starting school. August, uh, born with facial differences, his parents are Julia Roberts and Owen Wilson and people saying very good things about this film. You are not ugly, Augie. You just have to say that because you're my mom. Because I'm your mom, it counts the most because I know you the most. What I love about Wonder 2 is that the critics are saying good things just people like you and I that have seen it are saying good things as well and also those organizations in New Zealand that are designed to support people like Augie have used this as part of their mission I guess to raise awareness so good things all around with wonder and well worth getting along to see at Hoyts this weekend and a Kiwi Christmas is another one as well some familiar faces in here Sia Trockenheim who you might remember from Step Dave Will Hall from various things on New Zealand telly and started off on Shortland Street as I remember and Ian Mune the fabulous Ian Mune one of the great names in New Zealand acting acting royalty now of course Father Christmas or Santa as some like to call him is fed up with the materialism of Christmas, so he decides to come to New Zealand for a summer holiday and two kids figure out who he is so they have to find a way to get him back to the North Pole just in time for Christmas. Does anyone see you look like Santa? He's making a run for it, come on! It's called A Kiwi Christmas and it's out just in time for Christmas too. Funny that. Uh, another good one to see this weekend if you're heading along to Hoyts. And a big weekend in Christchurch this weekend too for live events. This is the South Island Wine and Food Festival. Something like 44 different wine providers are going to be at this one. And these guys, the Black Seeds there. That is a biggie if you happen to be in the Garden City this weekend and those fabulous black seeds playing. What more could you want? The first proper weekend of summer. I love it. Also this weekend, the Pop-Up Globe is back, I see, this year, this season rather. Amanda Billing is part of the, the lineup. Uh, and this, the thing about the Pop-Up Globe, if you're not familiar with it, is it's very much built around Shakespeare's Globe Theatre. It's in Ellerslie in Auckland, so just outside the Ellerslie Racecourse. And what's great about it is you're seeing Shakespeare in the way that those plays were written to be viewed. In the round with the gods and the, the stage that's right there. You could be groundlings right down in front of the stage or you can be up from a box watching from afar. If you're in Auckland or even if you're outside of Auckland and looking for something to do over summer, Pop-Up Globe honestly is fabulous stuff. So some great live events some great movies this weekend too and don't forget this is all with a big thank you to Hoyts and Hoyts Wido Park have got these recliners that we've talked about the reclining seats at the exact same price as a normal cinema seat tell you what they are so super comfortable you might as well be at home and your big lazy boy we love this for the standard price we love that too and I tell you what every seat every cinema and they are going to be bringing this to other parts of the country as well. So make sure you look out for it. But in Auckland, if you'd like to go along to Wairo Park, we've got one of five double passes to give away. If you'd like to head to our cafe Facebook page, just search the cafe. And once again, a big thank you to Hoyts. Lots on this weekend. Great movies to see. Great live events as always. Catch you next Friday. Fantastic. Thank you very much, Braden. And we'll see you next week.